bro. We don't want the fuck, bro. Oh, you know what the fuck, bro. Oh, you know what the fuck, bro. What's going on guys, my name is Face Jazz, as always, welcome back to a brand new video. So by the title of the video, you could already tell what this video is going to be about. Social media has been a kind of a shit show for me the past few days, with obviously Turner's post on Instagram and Twitter about his transformation, and there was a shit ton of videos made about it. Greg Duchette made a video, Kenny K.O. made a video, I say more plates, more dates make a video. I watched all of them, and they all say different stuff. They all think different stuff. Obviously, Tifu or Turner did watch those videos himself. I was watching his live stream on Twitch, and he was reacting to Greg's video, which is really, really awesome. Uh, let's see what Turner had to say to Greg Duchette. Jack. This guy's literally Jack. Did he do it with- Oh, he said I'm Jack, Chat. Ooh. It's really just the lighting, okay? Enhances, what is the actual story on this guy? Okay, so he calls himself a professional athlete. <laughs> That's debatable. I understand gaming Whoa. uses a lot of thumb action and wrist action, and really, how do you define what an athlete really is? Is he as huge as a pro bodybuilder? No. And just I'm not, looking at I'm that, not even that, that big, dude. Without looking at his back. <sighs> oh, yeah, I haven't, I haven't posted any pictures of my back, dude. Honestly, I think my back's more impressive than the front, dude. To be honest, like that picture makes me look a lot bigger than I am. Is I wish he would get more in depth onto like why he thinks that. He's, like, He's big. There's no way. Like, like transformation that most people would experience. Why is he like get into detail? PDs. So to think you're gonna get this. Wait, what are what are P PDs? I actually don't fucking know. Uh, that picture of me on the left is like the frailest picture I could find. But like, there's been points in my life where like I've been like bigger than that you know like previously like when i used to box like i was pretty built well, let's see the date on this this is april 4 2016 like before i started gaming i was like actually like athletic in 2016 i probably weighed like 175 maybe but like even like right there you know that's what i want i was like if i'm gonna if i'm gonna do this if i'm gonna grind and try to gain muscle, I want to do it like in the most effective way possible, you know? Let's just say Turner's transformation is really, really good and I'm really, really proud of him. Again, if you want to check out the workout routine, I made a video on it. The video is blowing up right now. The workout routine got over 5,000 downloads and it's free. So that's probably why if I asked just a dollar for it, you know, I would have been fucking rich. I like to help people and that's why I gave that thing away for free for you guys. You guys seem to love it. This video I want to talk about Tfue's diet and it's been a very big talking point of how he gained the way that he did and how it all works. So I want to show you guys these two clips where he talks about his diet that I clipped from his stream. Let's watch. Am I on a strict diet dude? I just don't really eat like I just try to eat fucking rice and chicken and fucking salmon and lobster and fucking mainly just a lot of potatoes dude and rice. Salmon and chicken. Actually, no, I eat steak sometimes too. I don't really eat that much eggs, bro. For breakfast, I had fucking potatoes, bacon, and French toast. That was it. Now, so obviously, you can hear him say that he eats a lot of clean, boring foods some rice, some potatoes. For his means, he gets fish, chicken, lobster, salmon, some steak here and there. And I told him to eat a certain amount of calories at least a day. That way, he's going to be in a surplus and that surplus helps him gain weight and obviously, in the end, also helps him gain muscle. Now, technically speaking, in theory, you can also gain muscle in a deficit, but obviously, Turner is not a super high-end, all-knowing fitness guru that knows exactly what to do. So it's obviously easier and better for him to be in a surplus because that pretty much guarantees that he is with sufficient protein intake and hard work and training that he will gain muscle and gain weight that way. Regardless of any accusations of steroids, PEDs or anything like that, SARMs, I've heard anything. I mean, even Turner did not know what PEDs even were. So, I mean, that does say a lot in my opinion. Like he doesn't even know. But okay, whatever, right? He still gained a, an impressive amount of muscle. But let's not forget that 
Turner and I, for example, started working in 2018, which is, I mean, like a year and a half ago-ish, we started working. I mean, this six month transformation is kind of skewed and it's obviously for the clicks a little bit and it's also the picture is a little bit older than six months, but it was, in all fairness, that left picture was similar to his starting point that we had in January, but don't forget that in the past, Turner had more muscle mass before. He was more ripped before. In 2016 even, if you look at this picture, he was ripped. Look at his fucking abs. Look at his midsection. How nice, ripped, and lean it is. Like, you can tell his genetics gift him with great abs. Like, you can just already tell. In my opinion, his abs are one of the sickest things about his physique. That's what I think. Because he has the perfect beach body now. Like, he's not too big. He has obviously some great definition. Uh, his nice shoulders, but his abs, like, that's what you look at, you know? It's like, wow. Just because we worked in 2018, 2019, and then he quit for his, like, he didn't do anything for a while because he was fully into Twitch, into streaming, and, and making his career there. He was very busy with that and didn't work out at all. Then when he back went back to Florida and his warehouse, that's when he purchased the gym, and he really wanted to get all in with it. It is the six-month transformation. It's not like he's never worked out before the six months, and he never had muscle before. So that's what I that's what I think that uh, Greg missed in his video. If he did a little bit more research, he would have figured it out. But honestly, I don't blame him. Like, I respect Greg and I like Greg's videos a lot. So I'm not gonna say too much bad things about Greg. Obviously, he's looking at it the way he present he gets it presented to him, which makes sense. But the combination of being genetically, as Greg said, athletically gifted, he is athletically gifted and he is obviously shown in the past that he is very easy to get on some muscle and to get a very lean, good looking physique. Obviously he didn't train to the extent that he did now in these six months and that's why Turner made this transformation as a six month transformation because back in January when I sent this, the push pull leg plan, the six day a week that you can download in the description, that's when he got really, really serious. He started doing squats, he started doing deadlift, he started doing benches, he started doing weighted pull ups, he started doing all the good exercises that you need to do in order to gain substantial amount of muscle. So that's why the transformation looks even sicker than it actually is. It's still fucking sick, don't get me wrong, but it's not the whole story. The picture is not the whole story, that's what I'm trying to say. The picture doesn't tell the whole story. Of course, it's a picture. So that's why, I think that's what Greg missed in his video, but that's okay, that's okay. The combination of already had muscle in the past, already shown the potential in lean muscle mass add-on by boxing and by doing surfing and like other other activities, you can tell he had some, some type of potential there in 2016 even. From 2018 to 2019, we worked as well. So he, he gained some muscle there. Then he stopped, lost it, got to his skinniest ever, which was around 170 pounds uh, for his 6'2 body. That's very skinny, obviously, as you can tell by by the photo, and that's when he started going back into it, but now this time going all out, like eating right 100%, working out right 100%. It makes a very big difference, and I get that the picture looks fucking fantastic, but you gotta understand that angles, lighting, and a pump make a very, very big difference. So that photo is on a pump with the perfect angle, of his, you know, his arm closer to the to the camera, obviously close to his body, so you see his full arm. Then you hit the down lighting on his shoulders, and you 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 poke up your trap like that. I'm like, if you train, he deadlifts, he does shrugs, he like he does all those things. Like he builds some traps. You can tell if you just poke up your shoulder, get it like fully, like you can really fake or you can get the best picture possible. That's what I'm saying. Like the picture does not tell the whole story. You gotta remember, if you look at it on stream, you, it, it totally tells a different story. Obviously he's ripped and like he's, he has muscle, but it's not as big as it seems on some pictures. So that's what I'm trying to say. Um, Turner, again, I'm proud of you, bro. You killed it. And not only did you kill it, but you, you have the power. You have the power to influence a whole new demographic and community. It's something that I've tried to do for the past five years. Try to inspire and get people in the gaming scene, people who are regarded as lazy or not athletes, as Greg said, like thumb action. Like 
I've been trying to break that stereotype for five years. And with one picture, you completely blew all my five years of work out of the water. Like you have that influence. So that's so nice and it's so good. And I think with the right guidance and with the right state of mind, people can achieve what you have achieved. The six months, I want to forget about the six months because it's a little bit skewed and it doesn't tell the whole story. I told Turner, the only supplements to take are a weight gainer at the beginning because he really wanted to gain some weight. So I said a weight gainer during the stream, that's good. And creatine, that's the only thing. I told him, make sure you don't touch any other stuff, you don't need it, it's fucking stupid. He said, okay, sir. And I believe him. If he tells me, I believe him. And that's, that's my response. That's, I guess, that's my response to the whole situation. I'll see you guys later. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. I'll be posting a lot more fitness content if you want to learn something or if you're a gamer and you want to try to get in shape. Stay around, bro. I would love to have you here. Thank you for watching. Leave a thumbs up and I'll see you guys later. Deuces!